Joker and Banjo, Battle of the DLC, uh, except not Hero because nobody likes Hero around right here. NC Ban Hero. Kind of. Anyway, getting into this game, let's see if Super Deluxe uh, can make it happen here. Oh, interesting uh, little up there. Gonna break that combo. And I think in this matchup, Banjo's definitely gonna be wanting to play a little bit more of the keep away game. You know, he's got some nice little disjoints with Kazooie and all those projectiles. And uh, Joker's really just gonna want to stay in Banjo's face, not let him get his setups. Uh, as well as just breaking any combos, because, you know, he, some of his moves are kind of telegraphed. So he might be looking for some Tetracons off a of Wonder Wing. And so far, uh, looking pretty even, but the bad man is out, which means uh, Super Deluxe can get put away very, very quickly. But actually going away there, gonna catch that Rebel's Guard and gonna put him away. Uh, and Super Deluxe putting away the first stop. I love the patient recovery from Super Deluxe. Just using his projectile, stalling his momentum, feeling out what Death Gun's gonna do, and then going to ledge. Throwing out that Wonder Wing, but it's not gonna do much at this percent. But here comes Arsene. But, uh, wow, 85% already. Super Deluxe with a nice lead. And uh, Arsene gonna steal that stock and smartly waiting on the Angel platform, letting that Arsene meter go away. Uh, but Super Deluxe, nice little lead right now, 80%, 90%. But those patented Joker combos, even without Arsene, he does rack up some damage. But going right through the Aga, or Aha, that's it, uh, with the Wonder Wing and stealing that stock, from downtown, these up air strings, so nice. And uh, Super Deluxe looking great right now. Recovering with the Wonder Wing. Uh, I find Super Deluxe is actually being pretty conservative with this Wonder Wing. You see a lot of Banjos just really throwing it out. Um, Super Deluxe really likes to hang on to it. Which is definitely a valid strategy. Uh, but now, look at this, up a full stock. No Arsene, and at 99%, uh, Super Deluxe looking great right now and sealing it with that... Oh, not quite yet. Never mind. I spoke too soon. Not quite yet. But at 124, Banjo can definitely do it. A grab will do it. An up tilt, any smash attack, Wonder Wing, or back throw. Landing it. And Super Deluxe getting... The first game, pretty impressive with that banjo. Well, let's see what happens in game two here. Oh, I, I, I looked away for half a second and I missed the stage counter pick. Gotcha, Smashville Hazards Off is where we are going. Uh, Super Deluxe sticking with banjo. Uh, Dylan hovering on the select screen, maybe thinking about a character change, and he is going to go Wolf. I guess he just didn't have uh, faith in the Joker in this matchup. Oh, I definitely see what he's trying to do here. I'm going to play a little bit more conservatively, conservatively with the blaster. Just trying to keep Banjo out. But then again, Banjo, lots of projectiles, may be able to get Wolf off stage. And uh, seal him like that. See what it is? Grenade? No, we're gonna go over his head. But Superdox doing a great job of maintaining stage control. But whiffing the up smash, and now it is uh, Death Gun's turn. All right, off stage again, throwing out the eggs, but just jumping right over him. Going for the down smash read, but it's not gonna connect. And now Dylan is throwing out F smashes, or uh, smash attacks too. We're even. 
Whoever gets the first stock here is going to be at a major advantage. Back throw? Not quite yet. A couple more percent would have done it. One or two more pummels, maybe. But the forward air will definitely do it. The big fisto pain. And uh, Super Deluxe with 89%. Looking pretty good. Ooh, going for the down smash read. Not quite going to do it, though. Nice read on the Wonder Wing. Getting a fair little bit of percent. And now Super Deluxe is off stage. Doing a great job of keeping him off here. And there it is, the boot, the dash attack. Going to seal it. And uh, now we're back up to uh, pretty even. But I love the edge play from both of these players. Both such a great job. Once they get their opponent off stage, they are going in. And... Oh, so here come the blasters. And whiffing the Wonder Wing there. Uh, Wolf well, probably not quite fast enough to punish that. But uh, still, down a feather, so... No two frame there. Was definitely keeping Super Deluxe uh, on the ropes. There it is, dash attack. And now, uh, Death Gun finally with a little lead in this game. But Super Deluxe is looking just fantastic right now. Well, obviously, he's ahead now. Uh, he has no reason to come to him, so he is perfectly okay with hanging back a little bit. Ooh, going for that up smash, not gonna do it though. Oh, but there it is! Getting that Wonder Wing and putting him away. Now only at a 38% deficit. This is definitely doable. Could This could potentially be a 2-0 for Super Deluxe. 14%, no combos off it. Ooh, he's throwing out these up smashes a little bit willy nilly. I don't know if that's uh, the don't know if that's the play, but powering through the projectile there with the Wonder Wing. But now Death Gun just keeping him at the ledge, racking up this percent, not giving him any stage control whatsoever. But we're back, and here we go again with the up smash. These players definitely just want to put it away. Uh, they do not want to let the Smash drag on any longer than they have to. And they have kill moves where they can definitely do it. Uh, so I can see an F-Smash or a back air. And Death Gun taking game two with the Wolf. Definitely looking a little bit uh, better in this uh, matchup. Not that his Joker was doing poorly, mind you. Uh, it was a very close game, but I think there's definitely a little bit more confidence in this matchup coming out from Death Gun. Let's see what the counterfeit is going to be. We're going back to Hazard's on Town and City. Okay. We are going to Town and City. And uh, staying locked into Banjo, but... Uh, Death Gun again, just hovering on the select screen. Could we see a third character, possibly? I mean, this man has a lot of characters. Very deep pockets. Uh, you name it, he probably plays it. Except, like, one knee sword fighter. But sticking with the wolf. Uh, don't if it, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. And here we are, going into game three. And aggressive start from both of these characters, not really just hanging back with their projectiles. They really just want to get these low percent combos and uh, establish dominance, as it were. Down throw. Ooh, cute little read there, but it's not going to pay off. Whiffing the Wonder Wing. And oh, I saw that F Smash coming out. But he is going to get caught.
just using those grenades, making sure Wolf is uh, using an option at any given time, you know. And uh, here we go. Oh! Just saw it and went for it. And oh no! I thought that dash attack was going to do it, but not quite. And uh, now Super Deluxe has a chance to make up a little extra credit here. Let's see if he can do it and establish a little, a little bit of a lead here. Ooh, going for that up smash, not going to do it. Death Gun definitely wants to seal this stock away, and it's still not going to do it. At back though, that was 150 some at the ledge. Good lord. But now he is out of feathers, and he is out of percent because that stock is done. Only getting 30% uh, of that lead. Definitely not uh, not too much of a lead to speak of. Because Wolf can definitely do that. He has those low percent combos. And just like that, we are back up to even. That blaster is so good at stuffing out Banjo. You know, Banjo is a little bit less of a zoner. You know, he likes to use his eggs and his grenades to really just get his setups for his big moves. You know, he's not really he's like a hang back and spam eggs type character. Uh, Wolf, on the other hand, he kind of alternates. You know, he can hang back and zone. He can go in and rush down. You know, very versatile little projectile. Down throw, jab. Okay. What's that? Take a note of the I was like, I and there it is, side B, sealing it away, and now Super Deluxe up a stock in this game three. Oh, nice! Two F smashes in a row. What? This man is crazy. He is feeling himself, and it is paying dividends. Man, Deckard, look at the oh. Ooh, SD, unfortunate, but Super Deluxe with a PR win here at Don't Till. Very nice showing.